guys and welcome to my channel today the video is going to be the crafting video and I'm going to show you how I build a training spot training room slash studio for Michael from Zen Dragon channel And yeah, this is the area I have already started and actually I'm close to the finish but I decided to make this video so you can see a little bit of the progress because before I took a picture of how it was before and how it's now so yeah, you cannot see everything because I don't like the recording when I have to work and yeah, I have seen this room a few weeks ago and there's a lot of mess, as you can see, including a ton of weapons, some of them for sparring. When I first moved into this apartment with my girlfriend, with the rooms upstairs and this area down here, the initial plan was to try and see if we could turn this thing into a small training area for yoga and martial arts perhaps for our project Milgan, so we can offer some more free training for people who can't afford it or don't have the opportunities. And yeah, when I was in this room, I thought like this is a really cool area to make in some training spot. And yeah, I asked Michael if he would like to do something about this and he was really open for these ideas. So yeah, I decided to help him with building his dojo one or just studio for his future recordings but now i will come back to work and yeah i have to leave it a bit the floor because over here is a washing machine and the pipe is coming in the middle of the room so over here over here is, uh, is the hole for the water and yeah so i have to do something about it and actually this looks pretty cool i use uh, osb wood and on the top we're going to put also this big wooden plate so it's more stable and I hope that today I'm going to finish this project and yeah this pipe is so annoying because I have to all the time try to you know cut the pallet so the pipe can go under also the floor is not straight because of this hole in the middle for the water and I have to put a lot of small pieces of wood under the pallet so the floor going to be a little bit more straight it's not perfect but i don't want to use so much time for this because it's not that important yeah so when i'm done with this I want to also put here some kind of table above the washing machine so Michael can place some random stuff over there what normally was in this area So I finished this table for stuff I already put some stuff over there and I have to clean all my tools and I should go home because it's Saturday and yeah, I promised to be at one and it's already a few minutes past one. <laughs> Yeah, 
but now it's time for the tummy and yeah and time to go home tortilla style so after we come straight again and yeah let's try so as you can see it's pretty cool so I think it's time for me today and yeah I think I have to finish this another day Now I think it's the last day with the Zen Dragon Cave project and yeah I am here so today the plan is to move the wooden dummy a little bit to the side because when I screw, screw it to the wall I one screw will go between the bricks so it will not hold so well yeah I have to also hang more weapons on the wall new light so you're going to get like a nice and white light for the videos so it's going to be more pro and yeah we are almost done so let's get started Exactly the same color to color. So we have something like this. What is going to be between those? So I just connect this cable to the lamp. So now we have to just try if the lamp is working. So let's see. Tune on the lamp. Yeah, so now. This lamp already makes this more pro. So, we do that like ever. Okay, so let's go further. Right now it's pretty much over. As you can see, now swords hanging nicely on the wall next to the another weapons. So yeah, I also put the lamp over there. I don't have a time to make this cable look nicer, but it's just details. And yeah. So now is the time to show you the final result of the Zen Dragon Cave and Michael from Zen Dragon Chinese already here. Let's take a look for the place. 
So, what do you think about this? Yeah, this is uh, pretty amazing. It's uh, one of my dreams coming true, just having my own training area. Remember back when I didn't even have really a place to live and stay, so this is so cool and would not be possible without Damien. Yeah, it was also fun for me to build stuff. And as yeah. you know on my videos, I like to do some crafting stuff, so it's a bit. And yeah, if you look the, if you like to all the stuff I was placed, the wooden dummy which you already made a while back. Yes. With the Sand Dragon logo and that's that's a lot of things to do here. Of course it's gonna be more self-defense like sparring because just like in a real situation, there's not a lot of space, there's a lot of places where you can hurt yourself. Luckily, we can uh, take these off. Yeah, you have also idea why I did this, so you can remove it and have more space. Yeah, we can... Uh, this is a place for everything from forms and practicing with the side and all kinds of stuff. Like, there's so many weapons, the wooden ones, and the polypropylene ones and foam covered ones. Uh, these are covered in foam. These are for sparring. And then there's the metal weapons, which are more for just practicing. I just, I just had a, a kit. A few of you following Sand Dragon may know. Um, just recently, and I can't wait till it grows up a little bit older, like five years. And if he develops a passion for martial arts, then this is gonna be the coolest playroom for him. Yeah, probably the place is ready, so now it's yours. <laughs> it was yeah. yours before, but now it's more. <laughs> yeah. So you can use, and I hope I'm going to see you in this place in your videos. For sure. Your channel. Yeah. I'm gonna use this place a lot, and I already have a bunch of recorded videos, so it may take a while before there's some new recordings from here, but for sure. And also, yeah. Got the DAO, yes. the equipment. I guess I'm also present for making this, so I also will show it later. <laughs> Thank you for watching, see you next time and don't forget to go and check out my channel. Thanks.